I'm a Vampire, as I'm sure maybe if you guys pay attention you notice I have a song called I'm a Vampire. And it's true, I am a vampire. I like drinking blood, and like, honestly, who doesn't like drinking blood? Um, you know, Jesus' blood when you go to church, I'm sure you've all, or maybe not all, but some of you have partaked in a little bit of Jesus' blood, and you know, when you lick, somebody cuts their leg, or you cut your leg, who doesn't like licking cuts and tasting blood? I love the taste of blood. I don't know what that means, but I know I mean it. Another thing, fangs. Who doesn't have fangs? I have fangs. I also have plastic fangs. So yeah, I got fangs. I'll show you my plastic fangs, I don't have them with me right now, but... That's the thing, like, when you immerse yourself in vampire culture, it's strange you actually start believing you're a or I start believing I'm a vampire, and I'm pretty sure a lot of people do, because you don't want to break character ever, because then you worry that somebody else pretending they're a vampire might think you're not a vampire, you know? But we all know, like, deep down inside that we're not a vampire, right? We might be, though. And I am, so I don't have this problem. Yeah. And I also, I don't know if you guys remember, but when I, one of my first videos on this channel, uh, I said I was writing a book called So You Want to Be a Vampire? And that book's pretty much finished, except not finished in a good way, it's pretty much finished as in I've quit writing it. And maybe I'll start writing it again, I don't know, but... Uh, I haven't written it for a long time, pretty much since NaNoWriMo, since I started writing that other, the NaNoWriMo story, that kind of like hurt my, I haven't really been writing much since, since then, so uh, maybe I'll start back, but I, I, I think I'm going to start a, start a different book, maybe about vampires too, but anyhow, so you want to be a vampire, the whole idea was vampires live forever, right, we've heard that. And the idea in the book is that vampires are spirits, and the the way how they can take human form is by somebody who loves vampire culture and thinks they're a vampire or pretends they're a vampire, and they say I'm a vampire and they really want to be a vampire. Then the vampire spirit can possess them, and they actually do become a vampire. Kind of like Spider-Man, or Peter Parker, when he puts on the black Spider-Man suit. Like, it's him, but the, it's the suit that's controlling him, you know, that's how the vampires... And, you know, in the book there's the vampires fighting against the angels to try to... To try to... Vampires are trying to, like, destroy the world because they want to find heaven. Because they're, they're spirits that are damned to earth. And, uh... They, they think if they destroy the world, then they'll be able to find heaven. So that's the idea of the book that I didn't finish. And, uh, yeah, and the whole thing is, you know, if you want to be a vampire, you are a vampire, because in the book, whatever, but, like, if you say you're a vampire, you're a vampire. Okay, so we're doing recommendations again, so I'll just recommend the book that I'm reading right now, it's Kung Robux, The Magic Six. It's by Grandmaster O.E. Simon. And it's written in poetry and it's really good. It's about strengthening your body and your mind and how they work together and there's lots of really good stuff in it and uh, really, really insightful. Adam, I'll see you tomorrow.